Okay, my name is Linda Lenhart. I am the chair of the Disaster Response Ministry for Penn Northeast Conference. And we have been coming to Back Bay Mission since 2005. And the story I would like to tell is about a year and a half ago, one of my visits to Back Bay Mission, I volunteered at the MICA Center, which is a new center, and it's a, a daily center for people to come in, take showers, wash their clothing, get a little bit of a snack, and uh, operate computers and have a mail for people to receive their mail. And my message to you today is that when you go to the MICA Center, you don't think of it as we and them. You talk to the clients that come in. Everyone has a story. Everybody has an awesome story. My story today is this one particular gentleman, when he came into the MICA Center, he was sitting there, not really looking at anyone, and I sat down with him at the table, um, trying to get him to open up to talk to me, and I asked him to look up so our eyes would meet, and something sparkled in his eyes to me, and I couldn't figure it out, but as we continued to talk, it turns out he was a pastor but he happened to be a homeless pastor at this time on bad times. So we continued to talk and um, went back to the volunteer home to talk to my crew and I said, we need to do something for this gentleman that he not only will talk like a pastor, but he will look like one when he walks the streets of Biloxi. So we went to Walmart and we bought him a gray shirt, black pants and shoes. And the next day I went back to the Micah Center and gave the, the bits to Miss Ethel. And uh, when this gentleman came in, she handed him the bag and he went to take a shower. But when he went in to take a shower, he was looking down, kind of rounded shoulder. But after he showered and put his new clothing on, he came walking out real straight. And he was looking at other people. So he could go out into Biloxi and really preach the word and look like the preacher. So the next day I went back to the Micah Center and he came walking in with the clothing and this time he walked in straight and looking straight ahead. So my story to other volunteers is we could be in that same position. It's not we and them, it's us helping each other. And thank you to Back Bay Mission.